Man, I'm so sick of that Donald Kane talking about I can see the American people gathered around their dinner tables as they sort out the bills. And he's full of crap, man. I know. I know what you're talking about, man. I tell you. Look at him. Look at him. I know. Make no sense. You know, I'm absolutely convinced that, that man ain't got no damn elbows. <laughs> Man, come on now. What make you say that now? Come on. Look at his arms, man. I mean, he got them little bitty arms. It's like he ain't got no biceps. It's got, you know, I, I mean, I know he was in a war and everything like that, but I think, you know, I don't know what happened. That man ain't got no damn elbows. <laughs> well, you know, they, yeah, they did say he was in a war, but, you know, uh, really, I mean, yeah, it looks like he got a little bit of arms. I mean, look like they got midget arms. His arms come out of his shoulders. They don't, they don't, he don't have the bicep, man. He, you know, he don't have no bicep. His bicep this big, oh. and his arms come out of his shoulders like this and stuff. You know, like a little bit, like a, you know, you know, like them dinosaurs. The oh, dinosaurs with a little bit of arms. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. yeah. President of the United States with those little arms like that. I know, man. I would love to interview him, man. I, there's a there's a whole bunch of questions that I think the American people would love to know. I would, I just wish I had a chance to interview him myself. You know what? I would love to interview him too. You would? Oh, yeah, I would love to. But what were you asking? Well, I asked him. You know, I asked him, uh, what does he think about the foreclosures and all these people that's losing their homes and stuff, man? The American people should not be held responsible for those who have acted irresponsibly and allowed their homes to be foreclosed. Yeah, you know what? I got a few questions I would like to ask him too. What would you ask him? I was like, you know, you know, you talking about to stand over in our right for about a hundred years, you know, you know, I like know explain that to me. I mean, what are you talking about? Yeah, and do you think you're gonna be alive in another hundred damn years? Something to think about. Yes. Yeah. Something to think about. You ain't got but ten left. Yeah, think something. How about, about another ten years? Hmm. It'd be okay with me to leave you in Iraq for another hundred years if necessary. I would hope the American public wouldn't have any opposition to that. And what other question you have for? Well, I want to know, um, you know, why is it that he voted down on MLK Holiday? That's right. He did. I forgot about that, right? Yeah, I forgot about that. I don't know why he did that. He voted down MLK Day, but didn't want to come to uh, come to represent MLK Day when he he running for president. Yeah. That don't make no sense. That ain't right. No, that's not right at all. I don't understand why he came. Why he... I made an error in judgment when I didn't or voted against the MLK being a national holiday. But since it's MLK Day and I'm running for president, then I figured that it would be a good time for me to recant that decision today. <laughs> you know, and then I want to know, I, I just got one trivial question. I want to know, you know, I want to know, um, <clears throat> with them little bitty short arms, how does he manage to wipe his ass? He'd probably be like a dog chasing his tail. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you <Yeah. laughs> It seems like every time you, you, you see him on the news, he's Senator Obama, Senator Obama, Senator Obama. You know what? I wonder does he ever have nightmares about that? I bet you he do. I bet you he lay in the bed at night and have a damn nightmare. Senator Obama, <laughs> Senator Obama. 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 Oh, gosh, I had another nightmare about that Senator Obama guy. McCain, what other talent do you have besides just being a, a war veteran? Yeah, what other talents you got, man? Memories of the corners of our minds. Misty watercolored memories. says my hair looks like a bird's nest. My hair does not look like a bird's nest. Not being disrespectful, but if we would go to war, I mean, you got little arms and everything, do you think that would be a, a hindrance for you? 
Yeah, let me give your arms and stuff. How would you, how would you get away, man? How yeah. would you get away with yeah. the arms? How would you? Come on now, give us. Tell us. Tell us. Tell us. Tell us, man. We want to know. Yeah. We want to know. Hey. Give me the arms. I mean, you know, we're in war. We need, we, 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 what, 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 what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Right, what you gonna do? Hey. Another hundred years, a little bit of arms, a hundred years, short arms, years, you know. short arms. I would have no problem fighting the war in Iraq, even though I have little bitty arms. If we were required to run, I'd simply do this. 